I would hardly believe that you were really the descendant of my hero. I'm just blown away. I'm about to leave for Vienna, and then Joey's going to come meet me. We're going on a little bit of a roots trip, looking at cemeteries and archives and documents, and we'll see how far back we get. So I get to show you all these neat things. You're okay. weird. I, I am weird, I know. There are just two types of people. The people who know they're crazy and the people who have no idea that they're crazy. I at least know I'm crazy. You will see things you would never expect to see. I always have been interested in memory. That was my dream as a little kid. It's in the soil, it's in the air. It is poetry. It is mystery. You must do it the rest of your life. Closed. Now what? We're going on a treasure hunt. 30 years ago, my neighbor told me, you have an American cousin here. Our families were separated after World War II, and they really had no contact at all. The major point I think what Randy always does all his life is bringing people together. We're tracing our family history back 500 years. It's nice to know where I came from. Not a lot of people can say that. We're essentially missing so many generations because of these atrocities that happened in Europe. So many people came without family, without maybe memories. I'm the only person in 200 years who wants to look at this, right? He died 400 years ago, and here we are in front of one of his books. To believe that something this old was owned and created by someone that I share blood with. I had this dream that I would start painting some pictures of the characters you're like telling me about. It becomes real, you know. I think for me at least, tracing my family history gives me an entree into the history of the world. It was like magic. From Venice, they go to Prague, to Vienna, to Los Angeles. I think I was maybe more surprised at how enjoyable it was for me retracing some of the steps with my son. It looks a little expensive. We'll take it. It's that time of life when you start thinking about, okay, who am I going to be and what am I going to do and how am I going to do it? I will always remember it. You could wear that to the Met Gala. Yeah, like, <laughs> I don't think I want to wear it. Uh, I don't want to end up like Shlomo Mocha. He was burned at the stake, after all. 